What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Marks the Eyeball, and I'm back with another video. And today in this video, as y'all can tell by the title, y'all see we're gonna be doing. Today in this video, we're gonna be doing something different from the other videos I've been making. I just thought I should take a break from doing that type of content. But before we get into this video, I'm gonna need y'all like, subscribe, and post notifications, and comment what videos you want me to do next. Let's get into this bang. Alright, y'all. So if y'all not familiar with the app Goat, Goat is basically like a resale app for like shoes and like clothes and stuff. Like, say if you miss a drop on like some shoes that you wanted, go to have them on their website where you can buy them. But the price just be a little bit more than what the um, retail price is. But they got like almost like every shoe on them. If you're familiar with StockX, it's basically like Goat. They basically like both the same thing, but. I prefer GOAT over StockX, y'all. I don't know, in my opinion, GOAT just better to me, more easier. But in this video, I'm gonna be showing y'all the process of buying used shoes on GOAT. This is my first time buying used shoes on GOAT. I usually just buy them like regular, I don't buy them used. I just buy them straight from GOAT. But this time, I'm buying them from a seller from GOAT. So yeah, let's get into this video. All right, y'all, before we do the unboxing, I just wanna let y'all know some steps that y'all can use when y'all are doing this. So when you buy from a seller on GOAT, buying used shoes, first, you wanna check out the shoe. Make sure it's like, sit right with you. Some shoes be like ain't gonna lie they be beat on uh some shoes be bogus like i don't know if y'all want like any bogus shoes but i be trying to like get the best looking shoe for like the price that i want to pay you know but if you find with the shoe having like a little scratches or anything on that some decent shoes on that but the price probably like not in your price range or something but that's still okay because you can negotiate with the seller one thing you gotta do is put in the offer and put the price that you want to pay on the and they accept it or they'll decline it or they just don't reply at all because they just want the price that they had on them but yeah do that but once you find the shoe that you want y'all would need to like screenshot all the pictures of the shoes screenshot all the pictures if the item was shipped and it don't look the same as in the pictures you cannot go back and look at the pictures and screenshot them again so you need to screenshot them before you even purchase the um shoe so you can send them to it if it don't come as it said me personally we use shoes some people don't like use shoes some people do it depends to me if they like bogus obviously i don't i don't want them but if they like still look like you know like they haven't been worn yet then they cool and some people like care about the bottom the bottom of the shoe the bottom of the shoe got to be clean if you buying a used shoe but me personally i do not care about that as you going the bottom gonna get dirty who cares about the bottom of the shoe after you have screenshot it and did all that man all you want to do is just purchase the shoe and the seller got 24 i think it's up to 24 or 48 hours to confirm your purchase and yeah they'll ship the shoe out to you my stuff took like it wasn't even that long because like the seller confirmed my stuff the next day I purchased it. I said it took about like a week for the shoe to come. It wasn't that long. It was like a quick process. But basically, the seller got to package it up. Then they send it to GOAT. Then GOAT got to verify the shoe. But one thing with mine, um, in the description of the shoe, it said the box was like in good condition. But when GOAT received it, it said that the box was badly damaged. And they offered me a discount on the shoe or I could have got a replacement. But I chose a discount and kept the shoe. So yeah, they sent me like, I think it was just like $7. They sent $7 back. It wasn't worth it, but I don't really care about the box. So yeah, I just took the $7. But after they confirm the shooter is legit and they're going to ship it to you, the shipping process from GOAT to you is quick, bro. It's take like three days, not even three days. It's like, it's just quick. So once you, once your shoes touch GOAT and they be verified, be looking out for your shoes because they're going to come like quick after that but after that call your package should be delivered i got my package right here it actually came today and we finna do an unboxing on this man and yeah we finna do this unboxing see what i see if it's like if we got scammed or is it what i paid for if it's not get my money back here we go. well let's open this up look like they take this back up Okay, so I can tell that goat on um, take my package because it got this on here. When my other shoes came with this, it was this in here from goat because I ordered my um triple black Yeezys from goat. Oh, yeah, let's take this out. And here go the shoe right here, the box. Look. Box not that damaged, low key. The box is not that damaged. Hold on. Little box. 
None up in here, just this. All right, so here go the box. Let me show y'all the box. What a box. It's not really that bad. Most of my boxes look like this already, but I don't need care about the box. I'm gonna throw it away eventually, but I don't got a box like this, though. I'll be keeping some on, but if I get the same box, I'm gonna just throw it away. But yeah, there you go. I didn't even tell y'all what shoe I ordered, bro. So I was, I, I wanted some, I don't have no um, Jordan 5s in my collection. I don't got like not one pair of Jordan 5s in my collection. So I had the, I was, and I was, I don't know why, Jordan 5's been looking like cool to me, I don't know why. And so I wanted some, so I got the top five. Y'all don't know the top five, I'm gonna put the picture right here or something. Put a picture of the top five Jordan 3, I mean Jordan 5's, but yeah. And we finna open it up, man. Got the black wrappers in here. Okay, so I got the shoe right here. Wait, first, uh, we got the, um, when you get your stuff from GOAT, when they check it, they gonna hide this up in there. This is the GOAT verification thing. Checked off all this to make sure your shoe legit and yeah, in good condition and stuff. But yeah, we got that. And you got a GOAT sticker. I actually lost my other one, but GOAT sticker in here. And they go to shoe right here, man. They go to shoe right here. See, look at this, y'all. Look at this. These is used. These is used. And you can't you can't even tell. I'm gonna try them on on feet. Look at the bottom. The bottom will look, feel me, look yellow. But I don't need cow. They look decent though. Oh, they probably got bent from them. What's in it? Y'all know what we gotta do, man. We can see if they cool or not. We gotta smell the shoes, bro. We gotta smell the shoes. When you get those shoes, you gotta smell the inside. They stink, bro. Send them back. Tell them you need your money back. They don't. You good. Oh, these cool. These cool. I thought they was gonna like smell a little something, but let's get the other shoe. Here go the other shoe right here. Show y'all. Other shoe, these the top three. Jordan five. Yeah, they look the same as um in the pictures. Look dust on them, hold on. Look the same as in the pictures. Let me show y'all both. Both of and we finna do it on feet, so I'll be back. I like my shoes, man. These are my first pair of fives. But let me know what shoes y'all think I should cop next. I think I want some more fives, I ain't gonna lie. I think I want some more. I got some in mind that I think I might get. But y'all let me know in the comment section. Don't forget to follow my social medias down here, man. And peace out. Stay tuned for more bangers. Let's go. Okay, bye.